All right, so vacuuming uh, part one. Happy M Memorial Day, everybody. So we're back here. It's been about a month. Um, looks like the carpet hasn't been vacuumed. <laughs> like usual. So, oh geez, yeah, look at this. It might have been that they haven't gotten here yet. But anyway, um, we're gonna use the sanitaire for the main bodies of the carpet. Um, and then I bought, brought my uh, rigid um, 10 gallon stainless steel wet dry vacuum. I got, um, when was it? May 4th of, May 4th. Um, it came with the two and a half inch attachments. Um, I didn't bring those cause well, it does have more CFM. This has higher airflow density. It ha the 1 7 8 hose diameter has a good combination of airflow and airflow density. So that, so it, and it has more attachments. So it's attachments handle finer debris better. The two and a half inch stuff is more for larger debris. Um, but I'm going to use the rigid for the stairs and then which you'll see in this video and then the conclusion and the dirt reveal will all be in part two when I use the sanitaire. So, um, yeah, we'll get started with the stairs. The stairs. <laughs>
just my uh, impressions on this uh, rigid after using it for about a month is I like it. Um, it's got almost if not just as much power as the 14 gallon rigid because it does have a six peak horsepower motor. So it's just as powerful or, or close to and but it's more portable because it's a 10 gallon. So, I mean, I was able to fit this in my car for transport just fine. I wouldn't recommend it for car detailing if you're going to have it inside the car. You probably want this outside of it. Um, but it does have uh, a good chunk of CFM through this hose. Um, and as I said, you have the option of operating with a two and a half inch hose if you want to pick up large stuff. But yeah, it's a good look. It's a good shot back. I like it. It's just the right size, you know, and I can walk it. I can just grab the hose and walk it like a dog, you know, and the wheels, wheels roll nice on it, you know. It is more expensive than the 14 gallon, so if you're going to keep it at one place, I would probably recommend the 14 gallon over this if you're going to keep it at one place because the 14 gallon is cheaper. But I wanted something for inside in, in my house, and this is a the right size. So, um, being it that this was the right size, I wanted to use it, buy it and use it. But anyways, um, I'll show the contents of what I got after I'm done using the sanitary. So you'll see the dirt I picked up in the next video. So stay tuned for the, the sanitary.